Welcome back to my YouTube channel. I hope you're all doing well. Um, I'm just doing a week in the life vlog for you. Um, tonight is probably not even a week to be honest, just a few days. Uh, but yeah, I really hope you enjoy this video. If you haven't done already, please don't forget to like and subscribe. And yeah, enjoy the video, guys. Behind you already. Oh. So, Alex decided to surprise Ben with a few pet sheep, um, which she has got here, three little ones. They're not tame at all, so she's trying to get them a bit more friendly, which is hilarious. Anyway, we've got the vet. We had the vet at the farm today, and the same vet is nipping down to check these sheep um, and scan them to see if they're in lamb. We're guessing that they are, but we just wanted to confirm. And Alex wanted a like more of a due date, so she's not stressing every night wondering when they're gonna lamb. So yeah, we're just trying to get them in now, and then they can get scanned. Put it down there, Alex. Just let him have a nibble at it. Heard him. Alex, what are the names? So, Maple's the bigger one at the back. Yeah. Badger, the one with the striped head. Yeah. And then Syrup. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> this is a lamb. Uh, the lamb is one, two, three, four centimetres across the belly at the moment. So, that's all I can tell you. <laughs> a few, a few weeks, weeks off, I think. A few weeks. Well, I'd say it's hard to know because I don't know what size lambs you will have, but. Well, it was to a bell tax. Oh, right. Do you need lambs? This is in lamb as well. The lamb is one, two, three, four, five. Uh, about 12 centimetres long, 12 centimetres across. So. It's got a bit to go yet, hasn't it? Yeah, what's this one's face look like? Nice. Oh, <laughs> this one's got, um, it has got some thickened skin under there. It does, I would imagine it's some sort of mantle. I'll just try on the other side to see if we can. <clears throat> it is a lot skinnier than the others. Because you can see a lamb there, but yeah. then if you're not, you're like, oh, my message. <laughs> but um, it's just not it's so. not the end of the lamb either. No, I, I don't think this one is in lamb, to be honest, but no. I'm just. I know, I don't think it is. No. You can see, no. The other two are. Right. 
shipping back there it's uh, oh, well, was a successful scam mm. i'm happy with that two out of three because this one's due in a few minutes yeah has it got a little bag yeah, Boobs. They're not big around, but they're there. They're also wet. All lubes. Right. Oh. Valentine's Day. Well, tomorrow is. So I'm cooking a cake and I put it in this tin, couldn't get it out of the tin, broke the cake a bit. Anyway, I've managed, well, Ashley actually cut the look out. Hack it! So, just going to decorate it with a bit of cream now and then um, stick some raspberries on it. But I'm pretty impressed. The cake actually is actually really nice as well. Tasty. I'm buzzing with that. I don't know where to put them. Oh, they're big, aren't they? Yeah. You can oh, fill shit, them in. that side's sliding as well. Oh, maybe we should have let it <laughs> Well, should we put it in the fridge now? Yeah. Quick, deploy it to the fridge. <laughs> How cute is this card? So it's from this girl on Instagram that I follow called Doodling Lucy. She's really, really talented and I love everything that she does. She really supports um, British farmers and that sort of thing. And she does like a limited edition for uh, like certain occasions throughout the year. And this is one of the Valentine's Day ones. There was quite a few, but this one's most fitting for Sam with it being a Land Rover and that. So yeah, I got him the card. I've written in it. I'm not going to show you what I've written in it. <laughs> And I've just set the table. So for Valentine's Day this year, Sam does look like most of the cooking in our house. He likes to cook and he always makes tea and what have you. So for Valentine's Day, he asked if I could make tea. So that's what I'm doing. Um, I've set the table. Obviously, I've got to, well, there is some champagne in the fridge already, but I'm going to put that one in because it's pink. So I thought we'd, we'd drink that one because it's most fitting for this one. Um, and yeah, and then I'm going to cook him his tea tonight. I'm going to put his card here. So yeah, cute. It's literally only lunchtime, so I'm not making any food yet. And I'm going to have posted this video by the time that I am making the food. So I'm going to make, we're starting off with garlic prawns. And then we're going to go with dolphin wild potatoes and steak. And then I've made a cake, which I showed you before. Let me show you now. So I made a cake, which has failed a little bit i kind of quite like it like with the bits of like it's sunk down there but it's fine it looks fine from the front i'm pretty chuffed with it and the cake is actually pink i think it'll taste really good so yeah so yeah prawns to start steak for um main and then my cake to finish and then yeah i've got loads of i've got champagne and prosecco ready we're obviously not going to drink all that it's it's a wednesday night for goodness sake and we're both working so yeah anyway i'm just making myself a little bit of lunch um it's quite out of my hands some more yeah. Yeah. lilies right so as you can see we're decimating all these flower selection um with six bunch six or seven bunches to make, so I feel like we're doing all right. Uh yeah, I think so. I'm thinking more yet though, do you not? So what do we need from here? Baby breath, green stuff. Brown paper. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's it. You could also get a bit of inspo. There. How much you've got it? Right, 
we were going to do all this at the farm, but then realised that um, Alex is at the farm and Alex is going to be one of my bridesmaids. So didn't want to do it there and ruin the surprise. Um, so these are all the flowers that we've got. There's more around the corner as well. We've got loads. And we're doing individual ones. So not everyone's going to have the same sort. So say like Alex is going to have a, a full pink bouquet and I think Anna will as well. Ellie and Liv are going to have like colourful, bright bouquets. And then Meg... Ashley and Bertie, yeah. yeah, they're all gonna have like, well. um, you know, a bit like eucalyptus, a bit more greenery. I'm trying to go with like what they like, so that's the vibe. Anyway, we'll see how we get on. <laughs> look so i don't know where we th we must have seen it on pinterest or something i'm not sure but anyway and then ashley said to me the other day she was like why don't we do an individual bunch for individual people which i thought was a really nice idea so say alex has got all pink because she's quite a pink girly girl Liv, we've done like quite bright colorful colors and so on and so on and then obviously at the top here we've stuck in one of these thingamajigs and put i've put a picture of me and the bridesmaid in all of them so we've got ashley there we've got meg ellie anna and that's a really special picture that that's the day before we put blend to sleep and it's like one of my favorite pics ever because it's so cute uh me and bert me and liv and then me alex meg and freddie were all on there which i think is dead cute as well so yeah and then oh yeah we then went to a shop in Garstang and got a load of these like love hearty things and they've all got different writing on them. So everyone's going to get one of them. They're all different little messages. So we just need to figure out. You did pick one. Yeah, in the shop. I was like, right, that could be for Meg, that could be for Alex, blah, blah, blah. So I'm just going to write the names on there and then they can get them as well. But absolutely buzzing with our little bunches of flowers. We just need to put them in buckets of water now so they don't you know, die, because we've got two days, is it two days? Today's it's Thursday. Night, it? Oh, is it tomorrow night? Yeah. Oh, min. Okay, cool. Yeah, so it's not tonight, it's tomorrow night, so we're going to, and then obviously to put them on the tables, I'm going to wrap them all in brown paper, but I didn't want to do that now and ruin the paper, so I'm just going to put them in buckets for now. Yeah, buzzing with them. Uh, right, we have just, we're on our way back from the hospital we've just been in for my knee uh thanks everyone who's messaged me and asked me how my knee is but instead of replying to everyone i thought we'd just do another vlog about it it's not all about it um but yeah bit of an update sam will perhaps best telling you because he reckons he's the next doctor of the year don't you love no i don't think i'm a doctor no i just think that you are the worst patient in the world which i'm not in a, right, basically, in a nutshell, the guy in France was adamant that she's done her ACL for weeks. Well, the weeks that have followed. <laughs> Ten days. <laughs> she's complained about the pain. No, like, I haven't, though. If I, if I touch it, if the dogs go near her, she's dead cautious. Yeah. But then just gone, gone to see a doctor in Chorley. Specialist guy. He's giving it a prod, a poke. I mean, Christ. You might as well have run over it with a tractor. And she's going, and he's going, does it hurt? She's going, no. No. <laughs> no, I can't feel anything. No. I wouldn't mind, but last night we were, I, I touched it slightly and she's like, ah! That's and then because this of last... the position that it's in, love. But, right, so essentially, guys, yeah, we need the MRI scan as soon as possible so we can start to understand what it is. Because if she needs an operation, we need that as soon as possible. Because if it's crucial ligament, we need it up, right? So you play it on a little bit, don't you? Your logic would tell you. You say to the doctor, like, he's flipping out, doc. That's all that. So he rushes you along a little bit. But no. Oh, no, I can't feel that. No, no. 
And I'm not joking, he might as well have been punching it. I was just telling him the truth. I said it hurt when he crunched it up, didn't I? Right. Well, you tell the vlog then, I haven't mind it. So, yeah, the doctor basically said it could be the MCL, which is down the side of your knee, or ACL, he's not ruling it out. Booked us in for an MRI. I asked him about work and he said, ideally, don't work, but I'm thinking we'll go back to work and we'll just see how we get on. <laughs> He told me not to use the brace, which Sam paid 250 euros for. <laughs> which I probably will milk in that because it keeps it in the right place rather than it slipping out. And we'll just see how we get on. But yeah, Sam's not wanting to talk to me on the way home now because I didn't play it onto the doctor. Oh. Anyway, that's the update and hopefully we'll get in for an MRI soon and see what it actually is. But yeah, fingers crossed. Right, so next step is we did all the bunches. We actually took these out because it was raining uh, when we did them yesterday. And I'm just now going to start wrapping them up in the brown paper, go into the restaurant in an hour or two. So I thought I'd do that now. I'm just going to pull them out of the water, dry them off, put them in the paper, put the pictures back on. Um, and I'll put the writing on the back so they can all like see what i've said and how i'm asking them and stuff and yeah so let's crack on our hearts beat to the city streets we begin to feel the fire we rise like tall buildings as the chemicals that take us higher Night's young, it has just begun as she puts her hand in mine. my um, Christmas pyjamas so happy with them and then I've tied them all with a little bow as well to make them look extra cute put them all in my little hamper and we're ready to go well we're not ready to go I need to go and get ready now I've got a hair mask in and fake tan on so I'm just going to jump in the shower wash all that off and then start getting ready just set it up so excited how cute does it look um, anyway, yeah, so we're in the private diary now. I was just seeing them because I saw Ashley talking to someone. Set one out with the flowers. Is someone here? Of course you are. Um, yeah, so set everyone out. Names, flowers and all that sort of stuff. And yeah, just need to find a lighter now. Have you got one? All right, got a lighter Put, um, to light all these candles and so cute. Waiting for my bridesmaids. I'm so excited. I'm really nervous actually. Oh, they're so cute. So happy with everything. It looks mint. 